what I should have done. I am going to be <laughs> moving forward. I hope to create a little bit more of a routine of taking care of my nails because they've definitely struggled a bit throughout the winter, the cold, dry months. And so I recently cut them short
and feel free to take sips whenever you like. I also, also, also thought we could light a little candle. Although I recently got us a salt rock lamp because it's just so soothing. The warm red light that it emits. Warm, soft red light that it emits. I've just got this little, well, this long, <laughs> that little beeswax candle that will just light doesn't have any scent, but I think it's just very comforting to look at the flame.
favorite show on Netflix. Whatever it is for you, cooking yourself uh, nutritious, hearty meal, or ordering in, you know. It looks different for everyone. reading that book you've been meaning to get to, sticking to a routine you wanted to set for yourself, having a difficult conversation. There are so many ways we can care for ourselves, this being one of them. Buff out 
feels that lift or split and crack. This can be very helpful for that, I believe. Um, in my experience, whenever I have a little split or my needle breaks a little bit, uh, going over it with a buffer and smoothing out the edge and kind of painting over it helps the nail last a little longer, you know?
skin off of your hand and leave everything really soft. Um, so I uh, saw Aid Splits use um, coffee, uh, coffee grinds, but I could not find any. Again, I've not been having caffeine. So I have shredded coconut um, that I'm hoping works just as well because it makes it has quite the gritty kind of texture that we might need. It's soft enough, but also enough to add some exfoliation, right? So.
this energy out for baby I understand so <laughs> lots and lots of love to you all this has been really really nice and I hope to see you all soon okay besitos Most of all, be gentle with yourself.